And so many of you have. Why is Southwest having all these issues, but not other major airlines? Part of the reason is Southwest has a unique and totally different operational plan. It operates on a point to point system as opposed to the hub and spoke system other major carriers use. Point to point means a single plane goes from one city to another and on to another. And if a crew isn't positioned in the right spot, there's a domino cancellation effect. And to make matters worse, the pilots union says the company's IT infrastructure is dated, even leaving crew members on hold for hours as they tried to get their new assignments as Southwest resets. Southwest CEO Bob Jordan apologized to the public about all this last night and his first public comment calling their network a giant puzzle. He said work is happening to get flights back on track before next week. You know, I have nothing but pride and respect for the efforts of the people of Southwest who are showing up in every way the tools we use to recover from disruption serve as well 99% of the time, but clearly we need to double down on our already existing plans to upgrade systems for these extreme circumstances so that we never again face what's happening uh, right now. And the U.S. Department of Transportation now looking into the airline's issues. U.S. Transportation Secretary Pete Buttigieg weighed in on what Southwest needs to do to alleviate the strain that all this has caused. They should absolutely be providing refunds for those flights that were canceled if passengers aren't able to fly or choose not to fly. But also things like hotels, like ground transportation, like meals, because this is the airline's responsibility.